Good morning, this is Tip Tuesday, and I am Lorraine Brock with Get Organized, professional organizer and owner of a company called Get Organized, where we help you get your home, business, and life organized. And today is Tip Tuesday, where I bring you a tip, and sometimes a little bit more than one tip, as in today. I am with Jan. Jane. Jane! <laughs> what, I just talked to you about this. This is one of our organizers with Get Organized, and I have known you up for about a year now, uh -huh, yeah. and I still, you think I don't even know you. <laughs> I struggle with the name, and I don't have any clue. Well, I have a friend named Jan, is oh, what it well, is. Okay. So, But anyway, <laughs> Jane, good. so um, we're going to be talking today about small spaces and products and ideas and tips inside those small spaces. So tell our viewers out there... Um, what we're going to be looking at today and then let's get some other ideas of what those small spaces might be. This is our houseboat on the lake so we um, come on here in the summer and fall and when it gets a little warmer in the spring and enjoy it just as kind of our little tiny house on the lake so um, it's going to be lots of little ways to uh, have storage because in any, any small space Storage is a big deal, so. It is, it is, it's wonderful. I mean, look at this, look at this. You got these boats and this actual houseboat, you can actually take out on the water. Mm -hmm. uh, it's just docked right here and we're gonna be walking through. Now, when you purchased this, you redid some things inside, correct? We did, we did, um, starting with the flooring and the walls we painted to make it look brighter and. It's uh, definitely brighter. I saw the pictures, it was dark. Yeah, it was a very <laughs> dark paneling because it's, it's a, we like fixer uppers, so that's what it was. Excellent. All right. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn the camera around and then I'm going to let you sort of walk through and talk about some of the items that I just found really, really great solutions and products for small spaces. And those small spaces, let's talk about that. You have a boathouse. It could be a tiny home. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, we have a, a small like farmhouse that could be a tiny house or a, you know, a second home. Mm -hmm. um, it could be um, pool, a, a pool house. A pool house. Uh, it could be even a space that you uh, that you rent out to mm -hmm. like an Airbnb mm -hmm. that you're really mm -hmm. needing it to accommodate different types of families and situations. Right. So I think this is something that you could probably put in a lot of different spaces, uh, maybe in a mother-in-law house. I yes. think we talked mm -hmm. about that mm -hmm. uh, in the back of your property. So I'm going to turn this camera around. Let's go inside here and um, look at what we're going to be doing. Okay. okay. So tell us what this room is. This is the, this is the one bedroom. It's got two full beds and two closets. There's not really any place for a, a nightstand. So we put the little pocket here for just tissues and, and the remote control and things like so that. that's like a bedside pocket. Yes, bedside pocket just tucks under the bed. Where did you get that one at? Uh, Amazon. Amazon. I've mm -hmm. seen them at Bed Bath & Beyond. In fact, we gave away one's bedside pocket. Um, to our viewers, I think about last month, but it was uh, it was a different color. But oh, what's this up here? And then we have just these little shelves if they want to put their drinks up there. Again, the remotes for the TV and, and the VCR or their or DVD player, I should say. Um, and yeah, there's one on each side of that. So you can put there's coasters up there. You at remote controls. I saw that. So this because there's no nightstand. You're using this. Now, this shelf is normally something that you would, people would put pictures on and just leave it there, but you're using it for multi-purposes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, I know these type of shelves come in um, long ones, which these are quite long. I'd say this is probably, what, about 40 inches long, probably 40? Yeah. About, about yeah, that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, But they do make these shelves smaller at Ikea. I've seen them there, probably Michael's, Hobby Lobby. And you can get them a little wider, too. A little wider as well. Mm -hmm. And uh, there's a little lip on it. So that's very nice. Good idea. All right, we're going to make our way into the area in here. Okay, um, we had uh, got rid of a little bit of counter space when we moved our refrigerator over. So we got this. The, the people that had the houseboat before actually used this as a table, so it was lower. So we just moved it up, so then it added some counter space to it, and you can get this at, at Ikea. I like this. Now, um, Ikea probably has this probably in a couple colors, but this is one of them. And one of the things when you showed me this, one of the things I really liked about it, like you said, is you can when you mount it to the wall, you can set it with a height. But this would be a great product to use as well when you are maybe in a laundry room. It's a, it's a mm -hmm. small, I mean, to be honest with you, a small space, laundry rooms are normally small spaces, right? 
and you can use one of these as a folding table in a laundry room yes. to get you some mm -hmm. extra space. Now you use it. Let's back up over here. Let me get a big picture. You use it in this kitchen here as a, you said, do you use it for like, um, I have used it for eating area too. If we've got too many people, we can, we've got a couple bar stools that that'll fit nicely under here. We have, we have the folding, we got folding. Yeah, show us what that too. looks like. Yeah. So you got some folding bar stools. Yeah. Nice. They're easy to put in the closet when we're not using them. So we can use this for eating area too. If nice. We need to. Nice. And then do you, you use it for prep food prep sometimes too? Yes. Mm -hmm. Food prep area. Yep. Yep. Um, very nice. Okay. So let's look at this product over here. Okay, this is also from Ikea, and I love this table, <laughs> um, especially since it has storage, and you can open both sides, so you can lift this up, just put the leg out, very similar to, to the uh, counter height table, and then it's nice for all the drawers, I just, real handy for my Oh, for, wow. For all my little um, placemats. 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 And then I have napkins actually on both sides because I have grandchildren. And then down here is the, the plastic wear. And you have your drawers labeled. Yeah. Organizer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And there, I mean, so with this particular piece, now this is from Ikea. You can get mm -hmm. this table. I think it's called the Norden. And you can get it for $1.99 at Ikea. And it comes in white as well. And once we pull it all the way out and lift the other side, we can get six people around it very easily. So six people. Now, uh, one of the ideas that I thought about this, and depending on the type of space you would use this table in, is you could get some really good rolling casters at the bottom. Mm -hmm. And if you're using this on carpet and you want to roll it out, and this yes. floor is easily easy, mm -hmm. right? You can right, slide yeah. it out on this floor. Easy. But yeah. if you have carpet, you could put those casters on there and roll it out mm -hmm. and then lock them when it's in place. So that is a great... And it just folds up. Fold that down. Let me see what it looks like again. Folded down. Look how easy that is. That is easy. And that's probably no more than about, I'd say, nine inches wide right there. Yes, probably. when it's all closed up. When it's yep. all closed up. That is excellent. Mm -hmm. Excellent. All right. So the next thing behind me over here, let's talk about these Ottomans. Okay. Yeah. Every piece of furniture, we also wanted it to be versatile. It has to have, has to do more than one thing. So these are all nice in storage. So it ha we can use it for seating. You can use it to, as a footstool to put your feet up. Um, so we, I use both of them with just put the extra blankets in. So they're really handy. So that's important because when you are buying furniture, for small spaces, you really want to look for furniture that's multi-purpose. Things yes. that will have coffee mm -hmm. tables that we'll use as an eating area. You can even mm -hmm. raise them and bring them to you. You yeah. can store I put, them. You know, trays on here, you know, and people yeah, can even sit here and have snacks. And... Or you can put these two together and then put a tray mm -hmm. on top of here yep. and make it a whole coffee table where you could serve yep. snacks. Yep. And mm -hmm. uh, that is excellent. Excellent. Okay. Um, we have one more. I want to throw this in. Um, you either talk about what's on the side of the refrigerator or that chair. What do you, what do you think? Um, well, the chair was my idea. Okay. I want to hear your <laughs> idea. So bring that table down now. And this will be our last tip for tip Tuesday. And this is going to be something we thought we might throw in. Yeah. This, uh, you know, when we have, we usually have probably another couple out here. So I wanted to have a, the chairs be really handy. Now I actually have some chairs in the closet that are hanging, but I thought I have just this little space right here. I want to use it. So we got these two little folding chairs and you just unhook this and they're ready to put there by the table. Wow. So it's nice and close. What a great idea. Let me show you. So you're using a bungee cord, yeah, just a bungee just cord. A bungee cord. <laughs> and and you're, you just put two hooks in yep. here and you keep two of your extra seats just hooked on. And it's not in the walkway. Like it's totally flush against the yeah. side of the cabinet. What a great idea for a little space. That you yeah. could utilize. Well, and I think that's the thing in a small space too. Things need to be handy and close to where you use them because if you get more than one person in the hallway, you're going, excuse me, excuse me. So <laughs> it, it works works really well to have things very close and easy to set up because if I have to go clear the bathroom or back to the bedroom to the closet, I'm probably going to ask to have at least two people move. Oh, <laughs> so, that's exactly right. That's you know. exactly right. So. Well, that is awesome. Well, I hope you guys have learned a little bit about using some products in small spaces. 
Um, you know, you may have a small space in your home. It doesn't have to be a second home or a recreation mm -hmm. area. Uh, it can just talking? absolutely be something that you, um, you just have in your home, you know, use these products to help maximize space. We'll try to put some links later on today down below of these products or a few of them where you can find them on the internet and order if you like. Well, I'm Lorraine Brock. Thank you for joining us for Tip Tuesday. And don't forget to comment or share any of our Tip Tuesdays post for the entire month of uh, February, including today's, so that will make you be entered into our giveaway of our table topics this month. And so next Tip Tuesday, we're going to be announcing the winner. So share, 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 comment, comment, comment down below, and you could be in our drawing and possibly win on next Tip Tuesday. Thanks guys for joining us, and we'll see you next week on Tip Tuesday. Thanks Bye -bye. for having you. <laughs>